Here's a question about music. As we all know, music plays an important role when making a film. So as a producer, will I be responsible for hiring a music composer and do I have to tell them um, how the music should be um, which best suits the story? Yes, you hire the composer, but you do it in coordination with your director. So you probably will both be listening to um, tape of composers and what they've done in the past in terms of movies and how they've put that, you know, aspect into the movie. And you will need to have a conversation about price and about um, how their artistic taste of, you know, but it's basically it's your director's decision once you've been given the parameters of what you can hire onto your movie. So if they're across the board, all the same price, then that's actually a decision for your director. So um, there is another aspect of that about getting copyrights. And yeah, it is your responsibility if you're going to use music that belongs to somebody else to go get, uh, you know, the clearances for that. And that's a whole other video. And um, it's a little bit complicated. <sighs> Man, I have some printouts about that from some lawyers I got to um, speak to uh, last spring about. Um, anyway, but I don't have that in front of me. So I'm just going to say, yes, you do need to get the clearances and make sure. And there's two aspects to copywriting a um, um, music. There's the performance and then there's the actual song. And so a lot of the times, if you can't get the performance, if you can't get, um, you know, Rolling the Rolling Stone version of Brown Sugar, maybe you can get, you know, your local band's version of Brown Sugar, and that will, like, end up being not as expensive. But you do have to consider both of those aspects of copywriting. And, um, you know, and that's a whole little complicated thing that I'm not going to get into in this video. And But maybe I will another time. So, um, but the original question was about composing, and really, unless it's about... P price or salary of the composer, it's really the director's choice.